Hello friend, welcome back. In this tutorial, I will be talking about Check My Links, a great tool to find the all links on a web page with their status code. Like finding broken links on a web page has become a lot, lot more easier now. You don't have to write the Selenium script or any kind of automation script to first get all the links based on double forward slash A and all those things you used to do and then getting the status code of each link verifying through loop one by one and all those things whatever you used to do it has become a lot lot easier now just in one click you will get all the links of a web page and as well as with their status code you will get how you can use it it's very simple here on selectorsub.com you will find check my links just click on this it will open the home page of check my links here here you can see the uh, chrome link and all other browser links so let's say we want to install it on Chrome. Just click on this. Here you can already see that more than 20,000 testers are already using it. You just have to click on add to Chrome and then add extension. I will show you like all the features and everything about this. It will open the home page of check uh, like install page of check my links with the like it has been success successfully installed. Here you will find the tutorial and the few steps to get started FAQs about this if you have any question okay after installing you will see that uh, by default check my links logo will not appear here on the top so what you can do just click on here uh, extend default extension logo here generally all the browsers are doing this now that by default extension logo doesn't come whichever tool you want to see in the top you have to pin so you can pin it to toolbar now you can see the check my links logo is here now you just have to go to the web page where you want to like let's say on google.com so you just open google.com and here you want to verify all the links of this page you want to fetch all the links of this page and their status code and everything you just have to click on this and see the magic it is fetching all the links of this web page highlighting them with their different kind of color status code like for valid link it is highlighting in this green color for valid redirect link in this color warning invalid link and here you see that <coughs> there were total links 626 how many remains in the queue all has been checked a status code we got for all of them cache false method get we have used valid link 10 valid re redirect 16 warning 0 invalid 0 you want to see the report you just click on this you can see the report here you find all the links here a status code there 200 300 you get the copy url view all everything you get it here here you have the option to let's say you just want to see the redirect link you can see only redirect link report here if you want to see valid if you just want to download the valid links report you can just click on here so you have all those options let's say you want to again uh, verify all of them you just click on this and it will like sorry you just click on this refresh button and it will again verify all those links so this is how it works now let's say if we go to any other website like selectorsub.xpath practice page here so again you click on this link you want to verify just click on this it will verify all of them 95 it is verifying q8 you can see that it is showing one invalid link knowingly we have kept one invalid link if you just click on this it will show you that which one is the invalid so you see that this is selector hub.com we have removed s from here so that's the reason it is showing like invalid a status code is zero if you uh, and here we also have given the recheck http status code so if you click on this it will like you will be 100 percent sure that this is the correct status code because sometimes there will be like cloudflare or any other server has been added in between for the security purpose that some servers or some uh, attack is not happening on the website so few companies few applications used to keep that uh, kind of check in between so they don't send the correct status code so for that we have introduce this recheck http status code if you click on this it will open a pop-up open the website and then again get the status and make it here again i will like explain this little in more detail so let's say we came to this mintra.com here now if you click on this it will very quickly verify all the links and here you see that all this is started highlighting in red color because their server considered that some server uh, like some website is hitting their applications and some bot is running so that uh, for that region it is started highlighting all the links in red because we are getting 403 status code for them so now if you click here and you can see that all is highlighting in the red color so what you see 
You see here recheck HTTP status code we have given. Click on this, it will open and now it has updated the status because it got corrected status code. So likewise you can verify them as well. If you want to fetch all like all status code again so what it you just click on this button it will uh, like verify all of them one by one and keep updating the status code for all of them so basically what it does open a link update the status open the link status update the status so it might take some time because it has to verify 400 plus so i'm just showing you that there is an option if like uh, our application is getting used you seeing that the status code is not correct here very few it will be like very rarely it will happen because of course like your server is not giving the correct status code for those links so that's the region otherwise it will be working fine as usual okay so this is these are the features which it has and now uh, there is another great feature is this that uh, like valid link re valid redirect link so by default let's say this color is like very close to each other like very green here and here you might not be able to differentiate so for that region we have given the option that if you want to change the color of this one so what you do you just click any of those circles whichever color you want to change and then you can like just move your cursor here uh, like this circle here and there and you can change the color as well so whatever color you want to set you can set accordingly according to your requirement or your need so this is how you can change the color as well highlighting color here if you want to close you close and it will all the like uh, highlighted color will be removed here again if you click it will come here like this if you want to download the report you just click on the export all download report the report will get downloaded here if you want to open you can just open this earlier there was a small issue that long urls were not appearing here a dot 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 was coming so we have fixed that issue as well now here and uh, here you can see the view report you can see the individual report you can download individual report as well if you want to again verify you just click on the refresh it will verify this again and here if you want to change some settings as well you want to exclude some of the U website which you don't want to uh, where you don't want to run your extension even by mistake you click on this so in that case you can mention those websites here here you can check the methods get auto check and those uh, small small settings as well you can explore if required otherwise like very simple plugin straightforward you just have to install and start using it it will be very very helpful for you to verify all the links and uh, everything finding the broken links on any web page very quickly it has become a lot lot easier also there was a small issue earlier sometimes what happens when you uh, like let's say you are on the report page or setting page or any local chrome extension like this chrome double forward slash like this page and if you click on this extension logo by mistake here after that it was it was a stop working like earlier this was an issue now we have fixed that so if you will even if you make any mistake also then also it will be working fine because uh, for the local pay uh, like local extensions page it will not be working local chrome pages it will not be working but for local html files it will be working if you want to use that so uh, how you can use it for local html file just right click on the logo here like this and click on manage extension here is scroll down and you see allow in uh, allow access to file url so allow this and also it will be working for incognito mode as well so allow you have to if you want to use it in incognito mode you just have to turn on this toggle as well now if you will open incognito mode it will be working there as well so earlier it was not working but now it will be working there as well another great feature it has that it also works for the shadow dom elements as well so there are like other plugins as well in the market so few people has uh, said that like those are not working but this will be working for this elements which are inside shadow dom so if you just click on this so these elements are inside shadow dom so you will be seeing that this is highlighting here as well so this element is inside shadow dom it is highlighting that as well so it will be working for close uh, sorry for shadow dom as well so i hope uh, you find this plugin very very helpful if you haven't used it please install it on your browser and test your links of website just in one click because many a times we don't even uh, test the all the links of our website and sometimes we used to uh, just post buggy release some broken links and all so it will be like very helpful in that case just in one click you can verify all the links please do share it with others if you haven't shared it yet and please give us a five star rating on the chrome store if you find it useful and if you want to add any new feature do let us know in the comment section or you can also 
also reach out to us anytime on selector sub website live chat is there and we are always happy here happy to help you guys and add more features in this thank you thank you so much please like this video and subscribe to the channel also check out these awesome informative videos and keep watching more videos on selector sub channel thank you